Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Let's talk about it media 21. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And please hit the notification bell. That way every time I upload a video, you will be the first one to see it. Note, all comments are alleged in our opinion and for entertainment purposes only. Where we discuss celebrity news, celebrity gossip, what's being said on IG, and also what's the hot topic on Google. So today we're talking about, it's being reported allegedly from TMZ that another one bites the dust, Kanye's fifth divorce attorney is out, period. All the details will be followed and broken down. So basically TMZ is reporting that Kanye has gotten rid of another attorney. Let me give you some general information of probably why. Did you watch my video last week when I spoke about Kim Kardashian and how she got out of her divorce with Chris Humphreys? It was being alleged that her mom helped her get out of that divorce and it was Kim and Chloe speaking about it. This is not something I looked up. This is not something that an article wrote. These items and statements came from Kim and Chloe's mouth. It was being said on the show, Keeping Up With The Kardashians, that Chris helped Kim get out of the divorce with Chris Humphreys if she stated she married him in regards to fraud and in regards to publicity. So I'm wondering if Kanye West is having problems with Kim Kardashian and these attorneys are trying to play him and he's too smart for the okie doke. He's a smart man. He's a bright man. He's not going to go for foolery. You got to be up on your game. You got to be up on your game. And I'm sure Kanye is up on his game. Kim pressed the issue to become single so she can date Pete. Now they're having problems with the divorce. And in their telling, we see what goes on. We see that she allegedly gaslights him. We see that she likes posting pictures as a single mom with the children and it's making it seem like he's nowhere to be found. We see what's going on. Many of his friends did not want him to date her because they knew that she was still married to Chris Humphreys and they probably knew back then when watching the show, the mom had said, the only way you can get out of this is if you state it was fraud and you used it for publicity and attention. Watch my last video. So I'm going to keep an eye on this in regards to Kanye and Kim's divorce custody issue. We'll see what happens. We know the, the K's don't play fair. We know that. And Kanye's not going to roll over and say, okay, I'll, I'll agree with that. Okay, I'll agree with that. There's more of the K's than him. His family is very, you know, loving and kind and they help him. But there's more of them that are millionaires than, unfortunately, in, in regards to Kanye's family having millionaires. So, well wishes to him. He is going to figure this out. He has to get an attorney that's not going to play games in regards to one, the law, in regards to some shenanigans. So, thanks for tuning in. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And also, it looks like Shani Jones is hanging out with some of her friends. Of course, this is her birthday month. She's going to have a great time. So well wishes to Shani Jones in regards to just enjoying herself. Kanye has had a lot go on in this year. Some great things, some things that have to be figured out. But can you imagine what's going to transpire once he gets this divorce and he can cut ties? Right now, Kim is posting pictures and outfits as similar and something he would dress her in. I do think Kay does not want Shani Jones to get any attention. I do feel, allegedly, Kay wants all the attention. She does. I feel that she wants all the attention and she does not want Shani Jones to get any good attention. I feel that. I feel that. I feel that. Because many people says Kanye seems lighter, smiling, enjoying her life, focused, doing business deals. He's done more within the last year that I've noticed in the last two, he's always, he's been doing great with music, but in regards to business ventures, oh my goodness, and don't get it wrong, the Yeezy brand's been doing great, the Gap brand has been doing great, so that all started, and it's been going on for years, so well wishes to Kanye. 
Well, with Sister Shani, I hope he gets an attorney that's going to help him and not play shenanigans. When people say, oh, that's a mess. Nope. When you look at it from a, a standpoint of knowing certain things, you see certain things. You're just not one-sided, one-minded. But if people can think what they want, I know, I believe, in my opinion, there's some stuff going on and he's not falling for it. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for supporting the channel. Please continue to like, comment, and subscribe.